Welcome back, collective. I'm here with some more reads for these dirty dick ass divine masculines and these delusional mental illness ass karmics, okay? Excuse my language, but that's just what they are. Okay, so it is what it is. <laughs> if you don't like how I talk, um, I don't know, but okay. Um, also, like, I want to thank all my subscribers for liking and sharing my videos. I also want to thank all the tarot readers that are watching my videos and giving me shout outs as well. I really appreciate that. I also want to thank everybody who has subscribed to my channel and helped me get this far, okay? I've only had my channel for a month, and I feel like my channel is just spiraling. I truly appreciate it. I truly appreciate everybody that has took the time out to view my videos, comment on my videos, okay? So thank you so much. So let's hop straight in to, hmm, let's see. Okay, let's see what the masculines have, are having. What are they struggling with right now? Okay, we're gonna see what they're struggling with right now. I'm not picking up a good energy for these masculines out here right now today, okay? This is a collective of masculines that are fucked up and down bad right now, okay? These are for the masculines that are steady running from the fem feminine, I'm gonna say feminine. See, if y'all watch my videos, y'all will notice that I be saying words that don't even make sense or just sometimes I mess up. And it be because I be getting so many messages and wanting to say everything at once. Like, my mouth don't move fast as my mind is moving. Like, so many shit be wanting to come out and I be talking too fast, moving too fast. So, don't mind me, okay? Don't think I can't talk. As I can talk, it's just so much information be coming to me and I be trying to get it all out and it just come out wrong sometimes, okay? So, okay, Spirit, give me a message for how these divine masculines are feeling right now today. Abundance, okay? And what else? What are they struggling with? What else are they struggling with? What else is the masculine struggling with right now? Okay. Discipline. All right. So these masculines is broke right now. They fucked up. They struggling. You know, they out here acting like they in a bag and they really not. They out here acting like they got money. Some of you masculines, you know, are walking around with the same amount of money, but you're putting it on the internet like you just making more money, if that makes sense. Like these masculines is flexing with the same amount of money that they have been having, the same amount. Some of these masculines, you know, got big bills wrapped around dollars. These masculines is broke because, you know, they decided that they wanted to live above, live above their means to prove a point to society, to prove a point to you, to prove a point to friends, okay, when they really didn't have it. I'm hearing that a lot of masculines have went and got shit that they really can't afford, you know, moved into houses they really can't afford, you know, are taking care of people that they really can't afford to take care of, all right? And they're struggling right now with their money. Their money's got them fucked up. It's got them in a clouded energy, a clouded situation, okay? These masculines are very doubtful and they don't have any dis discipline when it comes down to money as well. They spend money as soon as they get it in their hand, okay? So if you ha are dealing with a hustler or someone that gets money the fast way, okay, they definitely are getting money, but they're spending it or they have too many bills that's not allowing them to save their money or they're dealing with a woman that's spending up all their money or they're dealing with friends and family members that are stealing their money behind their back okay they're trusting someone with their finances and their money is being taken away from them when they're not looking they're not managing money also you know they're they're doubtful right now because their money is falling off they falling off they didn't lost a job they ain't got clientele the way they used to or just you know Whatever hustle or business they own or whatever, it's not going good, okay? And it's all because they didn't discipline themselves with how they were getting their money and how they were making it. Also, I got regret at the top of the deck in relationships, okay? They're regretting getting in a relationship with a certain person that has is draining their pockets. Okay, and I got friendship. They can also have a friend that they are close with or they, you know, always do favors for that told them to get in a certain relationship that's draining their pocket. Also, this friend and this person that they're in a relationship could be close and they're this friend that the masculine is 
been friends with and this person that they're in a relationship with could be working together to steal money from this masculine and they you know you could have been telling them this or you know they could have people telling them this and you know they they were doubtful of that they doubted that i doubt it i doubt they stealing money ain't no telling oh they can't i i know how much money i got and you trying to tell them their family trying to tell them they don't want to believe it but now it's starting to show and they regret that they regret that they didn't listen to you or whoever that's close to them. They didn't listen to them about this relationship or they didn't listen to it about, they didn't listen to them about this friendship. Let me take a drink of water. My mouth be getting so dry when I do my reading. I'm sorry. Okay. Also, they can have an envious person around them, an envious friend. Okay, so they're dealing with abundance problems, discipline problems, doubt problems, regrets. Okay, they're regretting not listening to the whoever tried to warn them of this upcoming situation that's happening right now. So that's the energy of this read. These masculines are being robbed of their finances or they've been being robbed. You know, maybe this person they were in a relationship with was, was supposed to be saving money. But instead, she was spending it. And this masculine finally decided to take a look into their savings. And the money that was made, ain't, it's not adding up. <clears throat> it's not making sense, okay? And they're regretting trusting this friend, trusting this woman who they're with. You know, they're regretting doing all the shit they've done for this friend as well. I feel like this friend could have been stealing money from them. Okay. Ooh, this flipped right out. DF will be happy with or without you. Also, you know, you tried to tell this masculine DF about all this shit that was going on, you know, and they didn't want to listen. They wanted to put friends and, you know, family and, you know, this relationship that they're in before you. And now they're seeing you be happy without them okay what else you've been exposed okay so this masculine has found out something about a karmic or a friend that they close with that has been stealing money from them or taking money from them and it's all happening now okay shit ain't adding up this masculine is wanting answers he's wanting to know where the fuck all his money is why the fuck you know have i been trusting motherfuckers with shit and it's not adding up, Archangel Michael. Okay, this masculine could be praying to Archangel Michael because he could be really fucking broke. He could be fighting a case and he needed this money that was in his savings to pay for a lawyer and now it's not there. Somebody is about to get their ass whooped. Not literal, <laughs> okay? Or somebody could get, you know, knocked out. I, you know, I see a masculine having a fist fight with a friend about some shit or something like that, okay? Best friend has been hating on you for years. So this masculine has a best friend. Like I said, I got friendship. This masculine has a friend that has definitely, you know, been taking money from him on working together with his karmic partner, with the masculine's karmic partner to steal from them. Okay. This could be a, a friend that has a secret relationship with the masculine's karmic. And this shit is all coming out. Self-love is the greatest middle finger of all time, okay? So this masculine had the chance to choose self-love and say, fuck this whole situation and be with you. But he chose to put all things that didn't serve him before you feminine. And now he's being fucked in the ass literally with all this bullshit that's going on in his life, okay? They think you... They think when y'all fuck, you can feel their love, okay? This is a masculine that's feeling like he want to come, you know, get some loving from you, express his love to you through sex. He's wanting to be held like a baby and cry on your shoulder, okay? Karmic sick from doing black magic, okay? His karmic could also be uh, getting sick or having some pancreas problems, some lung problems. I'm hearing reproductive problems. Might have to get a hysterectomy of some sort because of all this black magic that her and the best friend have been doing together so i'm picking up on a collective whose masculine has a girlfriend or a wife or a baby mama that's fucking their best friend and they've been best friends with this person for years and this relationship behind this masculine's back has been going on and they've been teaming up to save money to run off from this masculine meanwhile this karmic is also trying to keep you away from this masculine knowing she's in love with the friend how bogus is that how bogus is that? Nothing to, nothing to it. Make it happen. You could do it. 
get out of the kitchen if you can't take the heat mask on, okay? So now you are going through shit. Now shit is crumbling. Now you starting to see your the roots of your bad karma. Now you starting to feel what the fuck you put out in the universe and you can't take the heat. You want to come cry to your DF now and you want her to hold you. You want to make love and you want to express yourself through sex to her. No, 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 okay? No, 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 no. Whatever you're waiting for is making its way to you. And best friend and karmic planet against DF. What did I just say? This is a D, this is a DM that has a best friend that's fucking jealous of him. And I'm also hearing that, you know, this best friend and this karmic know something about this DM that, like I said, could ruin his image or get him in trouble or anything, you know, just make people not want to work with him or I'm hearing promotions. So, you know, he could not get promoted from them telling this boss something. OK, and whatever you're waiting for is making his way to you now. So this masculine has been waiting on a blessing. He's been waiting on his good karma, thinking that he does. He do fucked up shit to people. Yet he's thinking that he's going to be blessed regardless, no matter what he do. Well, Spirit is saying that even though this is saying it's making its way to him, I'm picking up that it's not, okay? Everything he's prayed for and manifesting is going away from him because he wants to keep being in the dark night of the soul even when he's had help getting out of the dark night of the soul. DM, April Fool's is canceled. DF can't be fooled by you no more. So, yes, this masculine, like I said, is wanting to come to the feminine, ask for help, possibly ask for money. And I feel like the DFs are at a point where they're going to be like, you know, kiss my ass, okay? Also, this is a masculine that beats on his karmic a lot, okay? He could possibly be abusive or being abusive to her right now because his money is not right. And this is the type of man, when his money ain't right, he's very angry, mean, and rude, okay? Very angry, mean, and rude, all right? They think love is only physical. Like I said, they, you know, in the past, they could have, you know, told you the way I express my love is by giving you money and paying your bills and taking you out, having sex with you, okay? He's realizing that that's not the case because this best friend and this karmic is definitely showing his ass what time it is. Well, spirit telepathic communication okay so you know you guys can be picking up that there's a lot going on right now with your masculine he could be trying to communicate with you telepathically trying to you know send out emotions send songs to you through telepathic you know connection you know songs are popping up in your head that you don't usually listen to that's him sending those songs at you so you'll go search them up and listen to them and then get in your feelings it's kind of like magic okay they're kind of doing mental magic with you right now because they need your help i was addicted to the way you pretended okay so you feminines have definitely got out of this energy you guys have got away from this masculine and, you know, at first you were just addicted to them. You were, you went for anything. You let them tell you anything. And now you're not doing that. And they feeling fucked up because shit is over there, over there at their household. Shit is falling apart because he's a player. You know, he fucks with multiple women. He abuses the karmic. He treats her horrible. Treats her unthinkable. He does unthinkable things to these karmics. Even though some of them do deserve it because they are, tel you, I was going to say telepathic. Well, yeah, they probably are telepathic. They probably telepathically send spells and send things to you to make them have, make you have fucked up energy when you wake up and shit. Because some of these masculines are with high level witches and they don't even realize it. They don't even, you know, they ain't even looked into these karmic family backgrounds. And they don't even know who these karmics are really related to, what they were into, what their family's generations have been into. They just got with a woman because she was beneficial to them and they didn't even look into who they are with okay but these karmics have sat and took the abuse you know they've sat and thought on it came this mat this is a masculine that's not home a lot so this karmic has had time to do spells and you know do witchcraft and get her revenge back to on him for being a player in this relationship this whole time okay and this masculine is receiving bad karma for having unchanged energy and having an unchanged mind no matter how many times the ancestors and spirit gods have came to him and tried to tell him to do right he was too jealous of you and your life he tried to break you down okay because you were a light worker and you you were following Sorry, guys i'm back but this is a masculine that was definitely Definitely, you know, jealous of you, jealous of your light, jealous of your creativity, jealous of how easy it is for you to learn and just adjust to your environments. Okay, he didn't have those traits. 
you know, he wasn't around people that were spiritual or, you know, just taught him the way of life. Okay. He had to get everything from the streets or from friends or school teachers, or, you know, he learned everything about life outside of his home setting. Okay. And he was jealous of that. What else spirit? Okay. Begging for attention. Okay. So this masculine and best friend wants your life and best friend is a snake. Okay, no limits, period. Wow, okay, so this best friend, well, he has no limits on the fucked up bogus ass shit that he will do to ruin this masculine's life. He's really, really jealous. This is a masculine that has a jealous ass, snake ass friend, and I'm picking up that this masculine does a lot for this snake ass friend, and it's not enough, okay? He wants this masculine's life. I'm hearing this this best friend wants you too, feminine. I feel like every woman that this masculine comes across, this best friend has something to do with it, or he always pushes good women out of the masculine's life and reels in snake ass women to fuck this masculine's life up. I just did a video about the feminines having best friends they want to fuck with them, so the collective as a whole needs to look around them and take a take a good look at who's around them okay also this masculine is also doing shit to beg for your attention he could be posting shit with this karmic to hurt your feelings hoping you'll come say something to him and then that way he can tell you how bad he needs you or you know he's he's looking for whatever he could do to get your attention at this point okay so I'm going to pull a card from my romance oracle to see how this masculine is feeling at this current moment, relationship-wise with this karmic, okay? So this masculine has a snake-ass friend that's possibly working with the karmic against him to get him fucked up. They could possibly know shit, like I said, and they're blackmailing your masculine. That could be a reason why this masculine is not coming towards you, feminine, because he can't. He has shit over his head by these two people closest to him, the two snakes that are on his shoulders. You know, they're using something against him to make him scared and stay in that position. He's unhappy as fuck and he's regretful as fuck that he allowed a person to get that much control over her. Okay, this masculine is feeling flirtatious right now with this karmic. Okay, what else? Or he's feeling like, you know, maybe this karmic is flirting with him and he's flirting back with her because she's possibly threatened him recently with something. Like, if you don't get your act together, I'm going to tell this. So he's kissing ass, okay? I got this could be the one. So, you know, he's feeling like, you know, maybe I'm just going to have to stay with this karmic because she's blackmailing me hard, okay? And there's two babies above these people's head, you know? He could be abandoning some kids to be with this karmic feeling like this could be the one or this karmic could have put a spell recently on him to just get him back in this flirtatious this could be the one energy express your love all right and then i got separation so this masculine is you know being forced to be with this karmic or make her happy flirt with her express his feelings because she's recently told him if you leave me if you think you're gonna separate from me I'm going to ruin your life and you'll never see your kids again, okay? So you see these babies over this man's head. I feel like he's thinking about the well-being of his children. And maybe to you guys, it's coming off that, you know, he don't care. But in his mind, you know, he's trying to protect his kids by staying with this woman because she got something over his head that could possibly put him in jail or just, you know, fuck his life up, period. It doesn't necessarily have to be a jail situation. It could just fuck up his reputation. Some of these masculines are gay and they've you know, engaged in gay activities with these karmics and they'll tell people and people probably won't want to fuck with them because this masculine comes off as an alpha. Also make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps. Okay, so this masculine has definitely had a spell put back on him recently to get him back in control because this masculine was coming towards the feminine recently. But something has changed, okay? This money situation, whatever's going on with this money situation and this uh, regret emotions he's feeling has got him tied to this karmic back, got him back tied to her, okay? So she did her little spells on him. Uh, it's not going to work too long. It's going to fade off. Give it about a day or two because, like I said, we're in a time where... They're not allowing that shit no more. The universe is done with it. But since the masculine keeps making himself accessible to this karmic, she's going to be able to put little spells on him that are last real short. So in a few days, she'll be back in her feelings because he'll be back, you know, feeling strong, wanting to, you know, get back towards you and shit. And she'll be trying to figure out again how to do another spell to get her back under her control. 
All right, so that's my reading for the Divine Masculines. I'm also gonna make another video because I got more to say. But yeah, this is this is deep, you know? So be sure to like, share, and subscribe if this resonated with anybody or, you know, if this is your situation, be sure to comment and let me know. Love and light.